Okay, let's learn some fireball mail. Let's go through it slowly, lick by lick, uh, phrase by phrase, line by line, and uh, we'll get this one knocked out. Lots of forward rolls in this one. Uh, it follows along pretty closely the melody. If, uh, if you'd like to hear the words to it, there's a real good recording uh, on YouTube that uh, Roy Acuff put out in the 1940s that I guess was the original uh, version of that song. But of course, Scruggs did it on the um, Foggy Mountain Banjo album, which is the banjo player's Bible as far as I'm concerned. So you may disagree with me on that, but that's fine. So this is the way we'll start off. Uh, we're gonna start on the fourth string, open, and then we're gonna fret it on the second fret, playing both of those with my thumb. Now the third one, is still fourth string and I'm sliding from the second to the fifth fret like so still with my thumb so the first three notes were with my thumb zero two slide now that that uh, slide is the beginning of a forward roll and the forward roll is four two three one four three one so I go fourth string fourth string slide on the fourth string and it's gonna be four three one that's my first forward roll. So, fourth string, four, three, one. Okay? Open, second fret, slide. And that slide is the beginning of that forward roll. Four, three, one. Okay? Like so. So once we get past that, four, three, one, five, three, one, five, three, one, five, two, one. So I have four forward rolls in a row there. Four, three, one, five, three, one, five, three, one, five, two, one. And I got a lot of open strings in there, so that gives me plenty of time to come back here to the fingerboard because I'm going to put two fingers down on the third string. Uh, and the two fingers are going to be my index finger on the second fret and my uh, middle finger on the third fret. So both of those fingers go down and I pull one of them off. I pull the middle finger off. So I'm pulling off from the third fret to the second fret. Okay? From a B flat to an A. Okay? Now that's the beginning of a little variation of an alternating roll, which is three, two, three, one, okay? Three, two, three, one is my right hand roll. I started with the pull off. Okay, my next little alternating roll, I say alternating because my thumb is playing every other note, so I call all those alternating rolls. Four, two, four, one. And the first one is uh, fretted on the second fret. Four, two, then open. Then I go five, three, four, one. And I'm back to fretting the fourth string again. Five, three, four, one. And then I end that with a, a three pinch. So all that uh, phrase will start with a pull off, the three to two pull off, third fret to second fret pull off. And my strings again are three, two, three, one. Then four, two, four, one, five, three, four, one, three, pinch. So taken from the beginning again, no zitches. I'm gonna start with my two open, uh, my two fourth strings, open, second fret, and then slide from two to five. Five, three, one, five, three, one, five, two, one, pull off. So all together, that sounds like. Again. Slide. Five, three, one, five, three, one, five, two, one. Pull off. Four, one, five, three, four, one, three, 
pitch. That's what I call the, the first line of the song, even though it's most of two lines on the page. But I'll call that the first like section of the song. Okay, the next section will start the same way the first section did, with an open fourth string, second fret on the fourth string, and same slide from two to five. That's also part of a four, three, one forward roll. Okay, so O, two, slide, five, three, one, five, three, one. I'm gonna stop there on the open first string. Now, these next quarter notes are going to be uh, going to match the D here on the third string and then the open first string. Right? Like so. So both of those notes are a D right here on the second string on the third fret and then the open first string. Okay, but I play them both together with my index and my middle. And then I take my finger off for open. So now that's the open second string and open first string together. So. And then I'm going to do a hammer on the second string. From two to three, I'm going to use my index and my middle fingers here on my left hand. And I'm actually going to use my thumb to hit the second string here just to get a good solid lick on it. And then five, two, one. And uh, that is just a leaving my finger there. Five, two, one on the third fret of the second string now. So I do my hammer. Well, I'll, I'll go back to the two matching notes. And then the open two and one. And my hammer on the second string. And then five, two, one, five, two, one, five, two, so I got three of those four rolls that are exactly the same. Five, two, one. And then a five, one. That's a quarter note. Another one here on the second fret of the first string. Now I'm going to do another slide from the second to the fifth frets. And that's going to be part of a pinch with my right hand. Five and one. I'm going to pinch with my thumb and my middle finger. I'm going to start here. And that's all going to be one quarter note, like so. So I'll go, um, okay, open, second fret on the first string, pinch and slide at the same time. Okay, so let's go back to the beginning of the second section again. I'm going to do the open fourth string, second fret, slide. Five, three, one, five, three, one. Match two strings. Hammer the second string. Five, two, one, five, two, one, five, two, one, five, one. Fret it on the second fret and pinch slide. Okay? Now the pinch slide is actually um, the beginning of the third section. I'm going to go five, three, one. I'm leaving my finger here on the first string for that two forward rolls. Five, three, one. Five, three, one. And my third one is going to be open. Five, three, one. Okay? So I just went from slide, pinch. Five, three, one. Five, three, one. Five, three, one. I'm going to do a pull off now on the first string. Second fret to the open string. Second to open fret. Second fret to open string on the first string. And now I'm going to hit the open second string. So I'm, I'm um, pinch slide again. Five, three, one, five, three, one, five, three, one. Pull off second string. And here's my hammer again. I'm going to hit this one with my thumb too on the second string. You'll, you'll notice from my previous lessons that I probably hit the uh, second string with my thumb more than a lot of, of modern banjo players, but uh, it's kind of an old-timey technique. Um, so I just that's just the way I've always felt comfortable doing it. Five, two, one. Five, two, one. Now there's two of those. My third one is going to be a five, three, one. 
but I'm going to take these two fingers. I'm going to move them back to the third string because I got another three third fret to second fret pull off here. Five, three, one. Five, three, one. And then open. Five, three, one. And then the fourth string is on the second fret. And then the third string. Okay. So I'm going to go back to the open first string and the pull off and the second string. Here's my hammer on the second string. Two, one, five, two, one. I'm leaving my finger there. Five, two, one. Now I'm moving across two fingers on the third string. Third fret and second fret. I'm going to pull off the front one, the, the middle finger, uh, to pull off from the B flat to the A. And I'm going to hit the fifth string first. Five, three, one. Okay. So five, three, one, open. So I have four forward rolls in a row there. Another place where I got this string of forward rolls. There's several places along here where I'm, I'm putting together three or four forward rolls. And this one starts on the second fret with a hammer. Two, one, then five, two, one, five, two, one, five, three, one, with a pull off, five, three, one, fourth string, second fret open third string. Now this is a little forward reverse roll actually. Five, three, one, three, four, one. So five, three, one, three, four, one, four. Pinch. And then another kind of an alternating roll because it goes thumb, index, thumb, middle. And it's four, two, four, one. And on both halves of that my my, um, I'm, I'm fretting the fourth string on the second fret. So four, two, four, one. And I'm going to end the whole thing. This is the end coming up here uh, with a, uh, just the standard Scruggs G run, what I call the Scruggs G run. Three, one, five. Okay. Three, one, five, three with a slide. One, three, four, second fret. One, three, pin. If you've uh, been watching my other videos, you probably got that uh, that lick pretty well learned by now. If you need to work on it, start with the open string. My open string rolls video has this as an open string roll. Three, one, five, three, one, three, four, one. Where's thumb, middle, thumb, index, middle, index, thumb, middle. And I just add the slide in there, here, and then the fourth string is fretted. Okay, and that's the end of the song. I go back to the beginning. Uh, start with the fourth string open, second fret, slide. Four, two, four, one, shrugs. 
little faster. taste of what it sounds like pretty much up to speed so we'll be back so strings and then slide from two to four on the third string then hit the first string open and the fifth string open and do a little strum so instead of uh one and two and three and four and one two i do one two three four one two three four okay here's the g run here's my ending uh, open three. And each of those notes of the slide are, are a quarter note. So open two, four, one, five. And open two, four are the frets. Second fret, fourth fret, then the open first string, then the fifth string. And a strum. Okay. Okay, hope that helps. Have fun.